Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Sixers here and welcome back to another episode of Grab the Ox. And sorry for it being a day late. No, actually I'm not sorry. Things happen, okay? Plans don't go according to plan. You have to like readjust while doing stuff, so at least it's here. Be happy that it's here. Be happy that it's here. You get good music, new music. Another week, and have to wait two more weeks. Unless you actually know how to find your own music, then you don't really need me. But let's let's get into what I'm here for, the musics. So first off this week we have it's actually a new guy. I've never I've never like ever ever seen this guy or heard any of his music until I discovered it. And he goes by the name of Take Five. Blacks contain yourselves. If you know, if y'all know what take five means, contain yourself. I actually like <laughs> Take five, if you're watching this, I'm sorry, dude, but like I laughed out loud <laughs> when I read this name the first time. Because, you know, take five to, to black South Africans, hey, it means another thing, eh? But um, this track is called Smoke and Mirrors. It's nice, I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, the sound is refreshing, well, to me personally, because I'm used to listening to like wave and like wave cloud rap and a lot of trip hop, and this is like, you know, like chill things. It's kind of like subsets, but just more jazzy. Could say. As you know, the playlist will be in the description. Second on the list, we have Brothel, the OG, the legend. If you know, if you've been, if you've been into like SoundCloud, like this scene of SoundCloud, then you're gonna know who Brothel is. So you get hyped when you hear that name. And he's coming through with this track called "I'm Sorry," it's spelled like that. It's a dope track. Just you know, go ahead and listen to it, man. And next up, uh, I decided to put in a, a young throwback. I think it was like 2016. This is uh, Sidewalks and Skeletons. Yes, so the guy's name is Sidewalks and Skeletons. The track's name is Last Memory. Out of like the entire 2016 lineup of songs and stuff that I discovered, I always find myself coming back to Last Memory. I just, I don't know why. It just, it just has that thing. You know? It has that thing, so yeah. Next up after that, we have Cosmic. It's like an interesting thing that I find like so fucking awesome about Cosmic is that this dude's 16, guys. He's 16 and producing stuff like this. <laughs> The title says it all. Homeboy's a young beat slayer, man. So, hey, shout out to Cosmic. Next up, we have someone that I have mentioned on this list before, and that's Ozone. With his most recent, okay, it's not his most recent release because he released another track after this, but I like this one more than I like that one, even though he did that one with Steezy Prime. Y'all know Steezy Prime. If you watch like episode one, two, and three, you should know who Steezy Prime is by now. I mean, come on, people. But yeah, you and I by Ozone. Freaking love this. And, like, my favorite part of this track is like, Towards like the middle of the song, like where he starts like panning audio and then the beat breaks again, dude. Oh. Fox wedding. Wave mob in this mother. Too little, too late. I'm just, I'm, I'm just gonna let the song do its thing and just wow you guys because I'm a big enough Fox wedding fan as it is, so I might just oversaturate it. Go and listen. I'm just, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna decide to like feature this kid again because he's just, like, honestly, he's just so damn talented. Like, I feel like we are, we're, we are all drawn to certain things in life. We're all supposed to have certain things to do in life. We all have our vocations, and I really feel like music production is Cosmic's thing, guys. Like, this, this dude, this guy, this kid is just, maybe it's because I'm a fan, I don't know, but like, just everything he puts out on his SoundCloud is just banger after banger after banger after banger and he's only 16 guys he's only six. that's the trip for me is that he's so young and it's just like boy boy you got a good thing going 
I hope you, like, if you're watching this, you got a good thing going, man. Don't ever stop being this track. is Ultimate with Steezy Prime. I'm gonna stop talking and move on to the last one because I feel like I'm dragging this out a bit too long already. And this, this, this is a special, this is like a really, really special track for me. Why do I say this? Well, I don't know if you've noticed throughout, like, since episode two, there's always been, like, that one track that comes from a car video from the... YouTubers that you know like that I look up to when it comes to automotive cinematography, right? This one is one of them, but this isn't one track. Essentially, it's part of like a 42 minute mix, I think, by Eric Dingus. First time I front no, it's not even first time. Second time I heard this mix is in Mike Cozio's you could say recap of XS Car Night 3.0. It happened like a few weeks back. Awesome video. <laughs> First time I've ever heard of this mix before. I heard this mix way back in 2015, actually, while I was just, you know, going through SoundCloud and just happened to stumble onto it. And I thought, you know, this is kind of dope. And then it just, like, for me, it was just like an, an awesome nostalgic moment to like hear this mix again being used. Like, you know, it's like a mix that you really like being used by someone you look up to. It's just like. Throw your hands in the air if you're a true player. I was actually chilling like this, watching the video for like the first two minutes, just like. Yes. So this is Eric Dingus, the Houston Appreciation Week mix that he did with October's very own, way back in 2014. Like it's an old mix, dude, but it stood the test of time for me at least. Hope you guys, um, I don't know, like, do you, do you guys enjoy these videos? I don't know if you do. They, they get like a, a really decent amount of views if you look at all the other view videos on my channel. But yeah, I enjoy making these because I get to talk about the producers and the music that I like to listen to on a daily basis. And you know, just let you guys, put you guys on the way excuse the pun you know what to do there's the playlist it's in the description it's gonna be at the end screen check it out hope you guys enjoy some new music and i'll see you guys in the next episode it's been your boy sixes this has been grab the ox i'm really loving this series man it's awesome see you guys in the next video stay fly